Yo, what's Gucci? Y'all go follow me on Instagram. It's your boy V. Yeah. Well, it's that boy V. But yeah. Okay, yo, what's going on, guys? It is Jomo here, and today I will be doing a showcase. Well, not technically a showcase, but a tutorial, I mean, where I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a USB mod menu for Xbox One um, and Xbox 360. First off, you need the console. Second, you need a USB that is a FAT32. Um, I'll show you that, guys, in a second. Okay, sorry about that. Let's go to the this video to get the USB mod menu that is 100% legit. Let's say that in a sarcastic voice right there. Okay, let's go ahead and download this USB mod menu. That's step one. Download the USB mod menu that you want. Well, first off, I've already got the menu, so that's fine. I've already got the mod menu that we're using, going to be using, in this today's video. We're going to be using Memes V1. Well, 1.3. This is the USB menu we're going to be using. First off, all you got to go and get is your USB. And I've already placed it into a folder. Uh, there it is. There it is. Okay. So let's go back and go plug in your USB. Let's wait till it pops up. And I'll just open up this in our new window. Okay. So go ahead and grab, make a folder in your USB and call it USB mod menu. Open that up and place this folder in here. Once you've done that, go ahead, eject your USB. And now we have to go over to the Xbox, okay? And as you can see, that's where I was just there, just to prove that this is legit. So you just saw that, and I'll just take out the USB from my computer, which is right there. As you can see that power button right there. Um, there's the USB, and let's go ahead and plug this into my Xbox. Uh, where's my flash? One second. Okay, I know it's a little bit messy at the back here, but let's go ahead and plug this USB into the front of your console. Okay, and now, as you can see, the USB is in my console. Okay, so I'll meet you guys back onto the Xbox. Well, actually, give me a second. Let me power this up. Go put the Wi Fi cable in. No cuts, no nothing, so don't worry. Alright, that's the power in. Yeah, I got a, a lot of monster stickers. Alright, there's the Xbox, and I'm just going to quickly go ahead and record on the console, which is actually pretty... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Come on, console. I didn't mean to press that. Okay. So let's go ahead and record on my Xbox real quick. And I'll see you guys on the console. Bye. Okay, now as you can see, I am on my Xbox. This is the 
this is to prove this is a normal Xbox, as you know. I'm just going to quickly um, go ahead and connect to my Wi-Fi real quick, and I'll speed this process up. Alright, as you can see now I'm connected to the internet. The USB is still on my console. Let's go ahead and um, put in my BO2. Okay, there we go. Okay, now it's reading. Alright, there is no need to um, select um, the uh, which storage device. It will automatically recognize it as uh, the actual folder, as you know. I'll go ahead and sign into my account real quick. As you can see, there is no cuts besides from a computer to my phone to the Xbox. That's the only cuts there is. I'm only speeding up parts just to prove that it's real. So, oh yeah, I need I need Xbox Live. Yeah, ropes. Okay. So all you gotta do now is legit press start match and there you go, there's your USB mod menu. But just wait, I don't need to show you this, just to show you that it's real. Ha! Psych! I'm just saying. Um, you basically got clickbaited, clickbaited into this video. Don't dislike, but the truth is you cannot USB mod Black Ops 2 in any sort of way. There is not even a possible single <laughs> way you can USB mod Black Ops 2. And I have made a video in the past that you can't do it. Um, I will show you up on the screen. This video right here that shows you that you can't USB mod Black Ops 2. I didn't go into depth with it. I did, but it did not have enough explaining. But, I'm just saying. I'm just saying you just cannot do it. Okay? This is just an update video. You can never USB mod BO2 at all and if you don't believe me this is still the exact same console as I sent signed into and it's a legit console and the only way is to get mods is an RGH Xbox and the only way to get one is buying one from me basically I'm gonna be making some RGH consoles and this Xbox right here is gonna be RGH soon going to be buying some parts bringing them in RGH in them and selling them but Every video you see on YouTube, not this one, this one is just to prove you can't USB mod. And obviously, you don't see the menu right there, do you? Um, and obviously, every video is out there is putting USB mod menu and having the titles that shit. <sighs> it's fake. Every single one is fake. They're all there, it's for clickbait. And views and all they want is the views and money I know I kind of did the same thing but not really I'm just proving that you cannot USB my backups too the main people that I was noticed is doing it is Hasey and I can't remember the other faggots everybody else is fucking doing them nowadays um they're all fake the only way you can get them is getting by co-host you can get calls from me if you pay me. I'll give you calls for a straight hour for $4. It's cheap as fuck. 
it's cheaper than everybody else's prices so and the other way if you're going to keep it permanently and know what to do is buying an RGH console if you don't believe me I'll go on my RGH right now and show you that's the only the only way you can actually get a mod menu is by doing this so I'm going to quickly go ahead and power off this Xbox and um, I'll jump over into my RGH real quick and uh, prove it to you there. Peace. Okay, so this is the part where I was talking about on my RGH now. If you don't believe me, here you go. Now this is my RGH Xbox 360. And no, you cannot get a USB mod menu or any mods on Xbox One. I'm just saying. Okay. So now I'm on my Xbox. Let's go to my games. XCX menu 1.2. Nope, don't sign in. Okay, and now all I've got to do is go to games, Black Ops 2, and then go for default underscore mp.xex. Okay. Now all I gotta do now is sign in. And all I gotta do now is just start a match. It's that simple. That's the. This is the only way you can get co-host at uh, a mod menu, or you can get a co-host by me and actually just buy co-host from my website. Um, it is 100% cheap and 100% legit. Um, all it is, just go to here, and this is how you get a mod menu. So that's a mod menu right there, and um, yeah. As you can see, I'm the coder of this menu, and um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye. Wait before you leave. Um, I forgot to say, USB modding is fake. Just like every single video that you see, and not this one, because this is the proof you can't USB mod Black Ops 2. So. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.